Welcome to the Get Down Podcast, right here with the boy DJK. The name, the face, it doesn't change. It's still saying DJK forever. Tell, tell, tell. And joining me today is a familiar face you already know. Nana Boache, Dusty, you is know. in the house. You already know. <laughs> you already know, bro. You're getting comfortable with too much. Yeah. <laughs> So no time to waste, let's delve straight into it. Today we are discussing the spicy. So let me just roll my hands before I introduce the topic. Today we are discussing building trust. Okay? Ways to establish and maintain trust, how to overcome betrayals, and then um rebuilding trust. What I say? She said you sit down that we sit down say boo boo or say you have to rebuild it. But yeah, I said no polish, you know. So uh, some way, somehow, I feel that's how our relationship is. Before we get into the conversation, let me share my thoughts on this. Before um, let me say something uh, small before we continue. Personally, I feel trust, okay, is the most fundamental basis to every relationship. And I say relationship, any relationship at all. But just that today, our conversation, you better let me see who to. Um, Lovers, you know, um, bear money or bar. I mean, that is what we believe in. Bear money or bar relationship, uh, your, you know, dating relationship, marriage, any form of relationship as such. Okay, that is why we are limit limiting ourselves to. Personally, like I said, I feel it's uh, trust, uh, yeah, the fundamental basis to every relationship. Some would also argue uh, the point say, love is, of course, love is very, very important. Love is forgiving, love is all that. But I feel say any pay there is not everybody that can you know have that kind of love to say agape love na nyanko pondo ni pana or suma and ebdoba Jesus Christ so be wunjeno. Nobody can have that kind of love. It makes me always stand it the test of time uh, test of time. You may betray you, um, your partner will cheat on you emotionally, the person will you know targets you or like worry you in any form of aspect. A few love wouldn't alone be able to, you know, hold that. So I feel trust is there. So trust me, love me. What I say, if trust is broken, love. Um, message trust me, love me. Trust me, relationship me. If trust is broken, the relationship as well is coming down. Um, saying that, I come to you, bro. What? My thoughts on that. Yes, 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 yes. Of course, I want to know. What do you think trust is? I want us to understand uh, the word trust and then, um, okay, how you think it's vital or, you know, important to every relationship. Sure, sure, okay. sure. Okay, I think you mentioned about a lot of things in the, in your intro. And then I think I agree with you to most of the things that you have said. Mm -hmm. You know, when it comes to relationship, um, personally, for mm -hmm. my philosophy, I believe that relationship stands on um, three three foot okay? okay and then for love to be loved for people to feel loved okay mm -hmm. i believe that if the, these three foot are not maintained or are not in good position what we call love would not be probably experienced properly okay okay i believe that trust is one of the foot um, i also believe that um, commitment is one of the foot okay. and then i also believe that pleasure is one of the foot so today being, I mean, I, I believe this topic would really do a lot of good to your viewers and then our cherished fans. And then, I mean, it will really spice up or probably they, they may take one or two from it. I believe that trust, I think that's the question that you asked yeah. right now. I believe that trust is more about um, showing reliability and then being able to maintain it through con commitment. Okay. Like following it through, through commitment yeah. consistently. I mean, it can, you can also expand it to a point where, I mean, trust is all about your ability to be vulnerable in the presence of your your partner or your yeah. being vulnerable in the presence of your partner. Yeah. I mean, not everybody can be vulnerable in the, I mean, vulnerable with your partner or vulnerable with anybody. Okay. I mean, so how you feel safe around your partner, mm -hmm. regardless of your flow, flaws and then imperfections i mean it spice up trust you understand wow. yeah, so wow. i believe that trust for me 
That is what I think trust is. I don't know what you also think about trust, though. Yeah, basically, I feel you, you've said it. You've said it all. Because um, I know it's like I'm jumping ahead. But we we'll analyze and then look at trust in three breakdowns. Okay? We we'll talk about trust, you know, the emotional part of it, the physical part of it, and the intellectual part of it. Okay, we are going to break it down like that, but let's just think what you're saying for time's sake. Because you want to run it down, we, we, we should be able to fix everything in a space of about 30 minutes. Sure, and then, sure, sure. If unable to do that, then maybe we, we well, do a we part two because this is a very important topic mm -hmm. we have to talk about. Okay, but before we, we, we move on like that, uh, can you share an experience where? Uh, trust was broken. Like it was a like game changer in your lie. relationship. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, okay, I, I mean, think... not to put you on the spot. Well, you I can share a friend it. soon. Well, I get. Everyone say what down for. Everyone say what down for. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll say it anyway. Okay. I mean, I remember those days when I was young, you know, and then I mean, mm -hmm. I, having to meet this lady, we were talking, we were trying to, you know see whether we were perfect for each other but then i realized that um i realized that along the line this person was was not particularly um, into me mm -hmm. i don't know what he was she was into me but i mean she was looking for other things you know other so Can you elaborate of, a little other I mean, it was money matters so because I wasn't really up to that standard at that time, mm -hmm. it sort of um, got her to look outside the kind of relationship that we were trying to build at that time. Mm -hmm. We were young, so some of the decisions were out of immaturity. So, but I mean, because of what she was doing, and I got to find out, yeah. I realized that this person is really not interested in building a relationship, but probably... You know, you know, like building a future together. No, 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 no. she's not really oh, interested. Oh, she in has that. her own or two motive yeah. relationship, or or the open uh, her own relationship. Uh, so now she was providing, and then you saw her doing things, and then that was a game it. changer for the you. The conversations that we used to have um, started. I mean, who's as it? There is no power behind conversation. I don't know how to put it. I, I drive the vibe and everything is now like that like, like because. This person was speaking with another person who was probably giving her things that I wasn't supposed to provide. Mm -hmm. I wasn't able to provide at that time. You understand? About, uh, about, so, about. I mean, I realized that you know, Charlie, I have to let, I have to ball out, bro. <laughs> ball out. <laughs> okay, 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 Charlie. Kafra. <laughs> uh, I mean, who never talked breakfast before? You know, you you talk you, breakfast. Uh, that's not open, so you did it. Oh, you did breakfast. You did lunch. You did lunch. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 That's the only thing. You see, I saw before chop, okay. So, um, like I was saying, let's break it down. Let's talk about the emotional type of trust. Okay, I think you okay, really let's let's start let's start with that. Let's start okay. uh, with emotional you've, trust. You've really mentioned a lot of things regarding trust. Mm -hmm. I mean, usually when you talk about trust, people always put their minds to um, lies, and then um, I mean what the, your partner mm -hmm. is doing that is not consistent with them and all that but we can actually categorize them into okay. um, emotional the lecturer and then yes. um, so physical so let's do that emotionally, so emotional. emotionally okay when we talk about emotional um, trust uh, i mean trust okay. it's, it's your ability to feel safer or without fear be without fear when you are mean? sharing your dreams or sharing your thoughts or sharing your feelings because emotions is all about feelings sharing your feelings with your partner someone yeah. okay so um, um things that which in happen, turn is definitely going to make you vulnerable that's definitely you know that's it. so the things you are, your, naked. Your wildest, <laughs> you are showing your wildest desires the yeah. things that causes fear in you the things that i mean makes you happy mm -hmm. you're able to share it with somebody you call your partner Okay, so if, then, you, if you're able to get there, then you, you know, if you're able to share that without feeling there. unsafe, yeah, without feeling unsafe, then it means that there is that kind of trust. You know that okay, mm -hmm. if I'm sharing this kind of thing with Asumesi, it's not going to end up, I mean, coming back at me probably in some future to come or tomorrow's ahead. Mm -hmm. You get it. Okay. So emotions, like I said, is all about your feelings. Okay, 
what you feel, how how well you're able to communicate yeah. what you feel with your partner without necessarily feel feeling threatened or feeling okay. unsafe about it. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that is what I think about the emotional um, aspect. Okay. So what about believing your partner, you know, will support and then validate your emotions? I mean, in times where you are down, you know that the person understands you and then they are there for you emotionally. Yes. You think? Uh, do you, don't you think that's also? It's, it's all part of the emotional aspect okay. of As trust. Of trust. Okay. okay. So your partner should be able to validate. I mean, your feelings. Okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, eh? When it comes to emo you know, we always say that women are very emotional. Women are very emotional. It is, it is all because. But look, you boys are emotional. Well, like, yeah, but it's like we we try to be hard. Who better than them another bisu? Yes, who better than another baby guy? Women will just. Oh my goodness! Women will show us. Outside, there's a little cry. Women will always, I mean, let you know as it is presently what they are feeling. They will probably show it off. If they don't even show it off, you will see it in their actions. Yeah. They can't really pretend much. And this will be another way. I mean, they'll show it off. But, but for men, pretend, though. boys know how to keep their our composure. You yeah. understand? Yeah. I mean, the thing they do about my challenge, you don't want boys to say that. And they, and they boys, 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 <laughs> boys will have, always be boys. <laughs> when you ask them now, you know. You expect say they are oh my nigga good day for me what I say. We could tease you. I brand you with Madam for your better say what I say. Oh who say you are you are vulnerable to that point that But don't you think it's something that also has a toll on guys? Personal as we being guys. So because usually it seems that because of this, you know, there's some sort of a EB expectation on guys that if you are unable to, you know, hold your way like that, people feel that but don't you think it also has an emotional toll on them uh, your, your like no, it's, I mean, your psyche and i'm gonna say bro i'm gonna say say you know i'm gonna say emotional way you know your mental health your mental health <laughs> hey, you're ready. You're ready. You're ready. You're ready. you know me i think i think the the general um upbringing of our local i mean i mean the general women of men in our society, local society yeah. has made it that way you know, I think particularly they they wanted us to look men to look like be behind to me and so that the <laughs> so that the other side of the, I mean the, the rest of the family will be able to rely on you. Imagine they want us to have that image, that identity, so that I mean, if anything, your woman should be able to cry on you, and then you would rather be consoling to you, imbibe a lot of emotions without you know unleashing it. Any any sort of I mean I mean Stress. weakness. Easy, you don't easy. you don't show it. You keep the composure. It's it's easy. Easy. <laughs> so then, man, you know. man, they die, pals, <laughs> nah. What's that? Yeah, 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 dying inside is. Yeah, smiling. I mean, I think that's it's that's crazy. that's how we've been. Brought okay. Up. All right. Okay. Then let's also look at the intellectual type of trust. Okay. What do you have to say about mm. that? Also, you know, a lot of people. We are learning no. Do you as just watch? You know, in as much as you leave your comments down there, also try to see something from this. We are all learning. You know, it's a learning curve. About yes, I, I believe intellectual trust is really important. You know, a lot of people feel like they are not compatible because of um, their level of intelligence compared to their partners. Like, yeah, it's true. Intelligence, especially in Ghana. Exactly. You go about your and then men in our the way we were brought up we feel like Crazy. men men are supposed to be the wisest sometimes yeah. which is not always the case i mean i mean we can testify that a lot of men are oh there are a, a, a lot of daft the here but then <laughs> yeah there are a lot of daft men and then mm, cuckoo, I mean, cuckoo men so, out there so yes it is it is you true know, it, it will surprise you that you get in a in a you see a relationship yeah. where when the woman um suggest an idea or the woman is making a suggestion that is really vital to i um, mean the relationship mm -hmm. and then i mean instead of the the, the yeah, husband, husband or the boyfriend you know listening to it in a good ear mm -hmm. they feel like no you are not wise enough to make that kind of suggestion 
we shouldn't take it. Even if the thing that the person is saying is right, mm. or even if the thing that is the person is, I mean, suggesting mm. will bring out, I mean, what what they are positive, positive. But... they will not even consider that. They feel like, oh, I have to learn over here. You know? Yes. Although, so mm -hmm. it creates a kind of friction. You know. So I mean, if because the person starts to have low self, if said the 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 lady is not really mentally strong, you start to feel like okay, I have a low. I mean, intellectually, I'm not really strong. Yes. So and it's not. Starts reading as I mean, if you want to complex, complex in the person, creates low self esteem. That's the word I wanted to So intellectually. Wow. You have to, even if you realize that what the person is saying is foolishness, know how to accommodate it and then address it. Oh, of course, yeah. You know, I mean, I believe that if you you are able to find a way to address certain things to, with people, with love, they get be they yes. get better. You understand? But uh, where is it? Kind of they shut them in their face. Way. Jimmy Cry. <laughs> 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 that is something that's really killing a lot of relationship and marriage is over. So a, you have that autocratic kind of. Um, we know, and then to me, and if you if 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 he says some, tell it that's it. What they said to if you maybe hear you might have this guy, but they make a new. I mean, it doesn't work like that. And it's funny how, even though when they realize uh, later on, they can't talk about it, they don't have. Men, there are a lot of men, their ego, a certain a a iPhone tower, an iPhone tower, as I said. Oh, so change, we are saying, you know, <laughs> for men, some men, and are some people to admit they are wrong, you know, and then come back and say, say, oh, say, say, no, or they will never do. Yeah, because maybe they have feeling like there are some, yeah. there are some women that you will meet that I've, I've met a couple of ladies, I mean, good friends that mm. when you speak with them, when you discuss issues with them, the kind of suggestions that they make, bro, the but I may be in your zone. You are like, I I this, in your this person is, I mean, intelligent. Some of them have no, very good books. Some of them alone. actually. <laughs> you see, if you go into a relationship with such a person and you yeah. decide to suppress them and you lord over them, I you mean, are, you are you are not alone. You are killing yourself. Mm -hmm. I mean, so you should. Because somebody will crack and say, you know, what's that so boy for? Your mama be boy, no, no. What they say? So if you are there and then you are not, I you know, <laughs> giving the person audience, ah, it's very bad. And then usually it kills. In this kind of society now. That feminists are also pushing the agenda, mm -hmm. saying, "Am I here, man? Who are you?" Now we might just walk for Bibi Baba, or any PhD, and I say, "I'm not on any dating." Or by we can say, "Crowd, crowd, we create degree," and I change it. What I say? Now we go be a woman, man, who are you? Saka kaku school, yeah, you know. Or you know, Saka kebi. I'm funny, I'm funny. Are you are like many of your boss? I stand by what I stand. You know, the funny thing is sometimes it's not even about the. The education, education yeah, yeah. Of, the, of the person, but no. <laughs> the person is well mannered, well thought. The suggestions that the person will make, you no, know, this person is wise. Yeah, you know, you, yeah. as a man, okay, as a man, you have to know how to accommodate such a partner. Not just a man, every person. I mean, as a I am saying, but well, you know, a man, 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 I mean, especially it usually it happens when maybe yeah, uh, they are married and then Obana na it yes always come more on the day. Remember that shit happen, bro. Yes, it's, it's, mm. it's, it's sad. It's sad. Sure. But it's one of the things that really deteriorates trust and then it kills it. Exactly. And then trust also there's like I was saying, who the six kills and is it? It's a shitty and there's any relationship. No. Is there any other point you want, you want to add to this? With a, you know, with intellectual, you, you know, with an intellect, intellectual trust, there, you know, some people are not able to get along safely with their partners or yeah. happily with their partners because they feel like when they are having conversations that, I mean, um, are intellectually inclined or mm. having conversations that's what gets them even intimate. Mm. And then, you know, so, so, when. When somebody is, for me, I don't know about you, and I don't know about others, but it is attractive when you realize that your partner is very intelligent. Smart too. I'm poor. You understand? It's very attractive. You are. You are able to have a kind of conversation. Some facial looks new. Some people are attracted to what's in there. They are sure are You can hold conversations that. Obey the ones I'm in there. They are really, really attractive. So people start to have problems. People start to have problems when. It gets a point in time where the, 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 their conversation is all about, I mean, 
last year. Yeah, yeah, you know. And Kylie is also as a in this modern time, as a most people don't care about a uh, you other things. Relationship people look at and as a man for sure in one in one boy is crazy. And you it's crazy. They don't care about whatever, whatever, whatever. But like I like I was saying, if you have a partner that is intellectually, I mean I mean and doubt and you are having conversation, there's even a turn on, you know. Turn on look how one plus one you are chilling to one plus one you two. <laughs> you know there's some there's some ladies if you throw a at them cry you feel like ah they're like they are they are out of the world you don't know like yeah, yeah, the race doesn't make sense to them <laughs> you can't add one plus one to you too you know but uh, 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 it's, it's, it will be hard being with somebody who is not that smart especially if you are a as a if you are up there no you be it's like once they say who do you that's it's like I just say like saying a joke it kills the vibe. <laughs> I said you have to come back and explain it. Sure people, people it. Like oh yeah, stuff. it's true. It's true. <laughs> I said what cause him here? And yeah. sometimes those in Japan, in us, so we were expecting in Japan, but as a joke. No, oh, bro. Like, you know, no offense. Like in an offensive way. Nah, that ne, I that ne. Come on, man. Last time. But I'm coming back later, bro. Can't, 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 can't. When, it's, when it happens like that, it's crazy. Bro. It's very, 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 very crazy. You will always be misunderstood most times. Yeah. Mm. Uh, and also, it's also the uh, it's a Kelly vibe. No. I don't know. Because every, every. Uh, ladies, make no guy lie you. Ooh. Your body, your face will attract them. But the relationship is just going to be like. It will go south. Because them are not know. I did I did that new in the able cost so bad. But why could JC do the answer over one for the life? I mean, bear man so so bad so. A man and sometimes they can compromise you. You better let me have a chance. Worry, I say, better relationship. Guiding him the answer back up. I could say, but they will stick to it because he can't. That one is true. That's a life giving factor. And still, I and also you know that it's affecting their mental health. But then later on, you be feeling safe with a different person. Papa could cheat. I could say maybe ah. I remember you know I was saying you see you know bro. That's why auto boys sit down now. What do you do? The one day. It's crazy. It's crazy. So let's let's look at the the last part, the physical type of trust. Okay, so the physical, you know, you know, imagine having a partner that you know that okay, we do bit more society. With mm -hmm. you know, for the physical aspect of trust, you should feel secure in the presence of your your partner. Yeah, that is one. Mm -hmm. Security is very important. Yeah, there are a lot of people that are very violent, and then when when I mean, I mean you, when you are you are in their presence or when you are at a confined place, it can, a person, and I was you, you feel you feel threatened. Your life is always under the, yeah, like in danger. Now, so the that still ever many panasa ako. So security, I mean your safety in the presence of that person is one. Mm -hmm. And also, I mean um physical intimacy. Being confident around the person, your your body being able to trust the man, you. Own trust your body and as you feel is you know, you know the physical the physical trust the cry uh, when it comes to when it especially in marriage. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we all know that when women give birth, their body undergo a lot of changes. Yeah. Sure. So if you are not with a partner that understands these understand things and then, then, then you, you are able to confine the person that okay, fine, mm -hmm. it's because of this that my body is changing. Um, so, uh, the person needs to accept you as you are, regardless. Mm -hmm. If you, you start to not trust yourself as a woman, most times, mm -hmm. and it becomes a problem. And then sometimes, some of these things lead to, I mean, break up, divorce, and all that, because the man now doesn't have the sense to reason that okay, this is this isn't how my wife looked before. It is because of, I mean. I want to maybe I will do something. Yes, yeah. Let me let me keep my I mean hold my children and be with her. 
they will start to chase other people and then the lady f the whole lot was a name lady no trust that's yeah, yeah of course trust don't trust yourself but trust you more uh, it will go off the roof off the roof but they say it's a cultural there's another aspect there's another aspect where intimacy I mean, intimacy. I think I'm intimacy. <laughs> so if if you are not if you don't trust somebody, I think it's very hard for you to give your body to the, to the person. person. Because Charlie, imagine say I mean as a acquire <laughs> <I mean, laughs> well, well, I didn't see that. Hey, you ma, I'm also a man. You want to So we are professional. We need you. You need for a doctor. We so need you. Need panda. Yeah, so we need you. You nobody can come for you. They say the only friend who cap, cap, who cap legends. In your man brand, then no. We didn't come here to talk about you. I, I just said Friday. So we said you're chasing a robot. Oh, let me finish. You're branded. What is it? You're branded. 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 Well, yeah. <laughs> I didn't say that. You continue what I'm saying. <laughs> so what I mean is that mm -hmm. for you to be able to trust somebody that you are with, mm -hmm. that okay, I can be intimate with this person without fe having any fears. That okay, um, if I'm, I'm um, I should get intimate with this person, it will end up bringing some, I mean, bad health conditions. I mean, that's. That makes spark up because the person is not faithful, mm -hmm. or I mean, you know, when when some people want to get intimate with mm -hmm. their partners, mm -hmm. and then this their partner starts to deny them. Usually, it may be because the person feels like, okay, I'm not the only person he's sleeping with me. Mm -hmm. um, he's sleeping with. Mm -hmm. he, yeah, only the guy is promiscuous. <laughs> okay, and but so, like, so they, I say in this part of our world, we have made it look like see that. Guys are okay to you know yeah, sleep around so and you know, people. Out, right? Actually, it's crazy. You know, I so mean, I don't really buy that idea, but not, ju that's just by the way. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. So, so they feel like okay, if if the, the woman will be like okay, if I'm there with this guy and then this guy is living with a lot of women, why should I trust myself to this guy for him to you know um, um, sleep with me or have intimate, like get intimate with me? Mm -hmm. You understand? Some people wouldn't like that. That is it. I mean, there are some ladies that even feel. <laughs> they, some ladies feel. I mean, um, um, light lighted up by the fact that the guys are playing around. I mean, oh, that is crazy. I'm those ladies are immature. Yeah, I mean, course. immaturity. Of course. About to her, they need just any clue and I'm a boyfriend and I'm for the other day. I mean, yeah. Okay. But okay. a mature old man wouldn't would want to. I mean, stay with the person. On himself, okay, we want a man or. Yeah. I'm, I'm sharing my bed with uh, Koju. Yeah. Koju I don't know how Koju. I also think say it goes beyond that, you know, to have that level of trust to know say if my partner goes out or Koyo Jumanaze or Kobe, I know say he is going to work. On you being quanko that on you being quanko here, right? I say to to have that kind of trust is also, and then one particular thing I think say we are forgotten we are forgetting is you know respecting boundaries. Just boundaries, I think. Respecting boundaries because really as a, a, a it's it's becoming some kind of way for <laughs> most people. So I say some kind of way because. Uh, most people don't know how to respect their boundaries. Yeah, you know, yeah. respect. Say, if you are doing something to somebody that the person is uncomfortable with, will be mm -hmm, say no. I did not my idea. I've got yeah, into so this yeah. limit. I have to stop. And I said I shouldn't be picking up my partner's phone in their absence. But then the key thing is also that the very moment you give somebody the way the feeling, say I have to pick your phone and have a look at it. Then it means uh, trust is always. Wrong. It's also um, it's shaky. It's shaky. Yeah. Neighbor. It's true. Yeah, because I mean, most of you, me personally, I don't like picking. If if say yeah, my name may go and I see me or her, I'm not gonna find the phone looking through it. Most times, the password can be new. But if maybe phone, I can set up my one because I feel I don't have anything to hide. I mean, 
but set, certain times you have to respect boundaries. Me phone me nya message on kofan she, and then also the email me phone she. But for it to get to a point where you would want to know what is going on there, it means that there is there is trust issues. That is a clear indication of trust issues. Yes, then in the I have a pascal. No, yes, I mean the moment somebody feels like I should be checking those things, then it means that you are giving them reasons why they should they should check. Mm -hmm. you know, if you are not giving them reasons, and no circumstance with the person feel like okay, let me be. I mean, randomly, if by chance what the phone number no or any man is good, but if they are passing, you are giving the person reasons. You are probably yes, yeah. uh, definitely the person will feel like okay, let me sneak in and make sure the phone. Let me share the echo so A B are not already. We A B B C man. That is that is it. It is trust issues. Trust. Okay. So um, when it comes to the topic of boundaries. Are you also the kind of person that uh, you respect say and find my phone? My phone yeah, my phone. Never pick my phone. The moment you make it that way, eh? <laughs> this topic we have to talk about this thing, particularly separately. Yeah, I think I think I think mm -hmm. they will separate it. Mm -hmm. But let's touch on it more than we move. I think the moment you you you, you start to make it like my phone when you be an agent. My phone yeah, find my phone that <laughs> what are you hiding from the world? <laughs> you understand? I mean, I don't think you should do that. Mm -hmm. I don't think you should. But but that being said, let let's create the balance. Okay. You see things. I mean, it's the, I, f I feel like it's disrespectful when you always want to run to your partner's phone mm -hmm. to find out whether there are other people there. Go up up day, that's, go up up day, go that's, I mean, you you get it. So yeah. that balance should be there. So it's your responsibility not to be so <coughs> inquisitive to the point that you always want to see what is going on on their phone, and yeah. then also it is also a responsibility to the for the other person or both parties to know that okay, we shouldn't be hiding anything if we are in. But, I mean, but will it be wrong to when your corner go for your fashion or the brother? It's not wrong. I mean, I mean <laughs> unless you have something to hide. Seriously, <laughs> what is wrong about? Imagine the cool. Ah, bro, over to you. Bro, imagine that one that that lady. When you call me, girl, when you when you call me, girl, no girl, no. Now, maybe I will join. Now, girl, I prefer the phone. I mean, I prefer the phone. No, I mean, 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 prefer those things, man. I don't know anymore. More hide it. That is why. Okay. <laughs> okay. So on this topic about you know breaking trust and that, that you know, unfortunately we know that trust can be broken. Can be broken. Okay. And then um, let's look at it from this way. I want you to you know, look. I mean, can I say, you know, uh, let's talk about some of the things you know you do to get trust broken. We, from there, then we take it to how to rebuild trust and then how to repair the damage. Okay. Yeah. So trust, like I said, like we rightly defined, is about I mean being reliable and then showing it consistently yeah. through commitment. Yeah. Okay. So the the moment um, you basically the underlying cause of yeah, yeah. <clears throat> the underlying cause of um, a shaky trust mm. is lies. I mean lies. That's an underlying mm -hmm. cause. The moment what people believe about you begins to change, mm -hmm. you know, I believe that okay, you are a man of your words. If you say this, you mean it, and you you show it, and then suddenly you are not showing it. You are not doing what you stood for. What I know you to stand for. I said, look at you watching. Ah, sometimes I can be petty. What like, I'll call you in thirty minutes time. Thirty minutes time, one friend, one friend, one after. Like, I did that thirty minutes. That's all. Oh, <laughs> just, 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 I'm just, I'm just, oh, just, 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 <laughs> you know. So the moment that happens mm -hmm. over a period of time, and the person realizes it, that is when the person starts to, you know, have trust issues. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the underlying cause of trust issues is yeah. lies, lies and betrayal, lies and betrayal, lies. Mm -hmm. The moment you are you. What's what's and turn on a wuja? They are all coming. You know, you are not standing for what you are saying. Busy or smart? Me kaze ne say so. Kaze ne be me. You know, the moment they start heading towards that, people um, start to question their, I mean, the trust, their perception about you. Yeah. So, sure. And that whole thing begins to, I mean, the, the yeah. trust. 
and everything. Mm-hmm. That's, okay. that's the other variable. <laughs> so you are saying lies and betrayal, inconsistency, and what about neglect? As a way you were near any panel, you know, not being there for the person. It's, it's all. It, it will send some form of sign. Say, I mean, maybe I will. Well, there was usually who feel be man, the person feels as when you before from. Mm. Oh, definitely. And, then, and it will it will have way on the on the trust. Definitely. Okay. Definitely. But funny enough, as we are talking about lies and betrayal, it, it looks as if say that is one of the the. It's like the only thing people look at. When they are talking about trust, yeah, it's true. It's be a nipana betray me. Well, between or because we be between the trust and as it be a nipana GT on on him. Mm. But they forget about Some you know the emotional no. parts and the intellectual parts of way the trust itself. So which I feel is is something we have to you know educate ourselves. Mm. Everybody watching out there and yeah, uh, those we because funny enough, these are most. Of the things that are affecting relationship, ah, people don't pay attention. People don't even pay attention to, not because they are depending on you, mm-hmm. but you know you don't respect the person's you know intellectual way or share the ideas. No, no, about about to, to, she will be now. What I said, or she will be kid to her be the person or in pan because idea, you know, for just a day or two. The, the, the kind of audience the person will give mm-hmm. to her, and I said to give to him. The person will feel safe with the person. We feel this. Oh, I mean, this person is there for me. What am I say to this it. level? So, guys and ladies out there, if you want to spice up your relationship, these are things you have to look out for. What I say: the emotional, the intellectual, and then the physical. We need We always dwell on the physical. Say, me what betray me trust. if you sleep with somebody will betray me trust you are, you are doing things that is causing what i say you are doing like things yes these things they are linked you are doing things that is causing the person to give attention to somebody else yeah. but you don't realize so it's something you know, you know we young kids out there we have to look at if you want to build a proper relationship me i'm not i'm not 100 percent a saint i have i had to sit down analyze things um as well i think that you also you yeah, sat down and analyze true. certain things we, we say certain things from real life and then things we've seen from other people Definitely. and then we gather together to you know bring out this um educational you know talk okay so like they said you never know what you have yeah until it's gone you know say when the trust uh, when trust trust i didn't even trust no t-r-u-s-t full stop <laughs> so i don't know when it's broken then you realize that hey, you were getting certain things you were not getting from that person. And so, it won't, this might not work for everybody, but from experience, what are some of the things you feel someone can do? What I say, and as I know from experience or from what you've learned, I mean, it's just an experience. What are some of the things you feel some, someone can do to, you know, to help them rebuild trust, trust in their relationship? So it's, that's the, the next point we are talking it's, about. It's really a good point that we, would want to, you, we are about to talk about. Yeah. Um, personally, I believe that if there is a problem, generally, yeah. we have to identify the problem first. Yeah. Okay. You, our, our, I mean, admitting to the cause of the problem is part of the solution. Mm-hmm. Okay. So if, if we know that, okay, this was a reason why um we we f- we fell we, out we fell out we got to this point we should yeah. we should know so our identification of the problem is a vital part yeah okay because of, most times eh, it was a bright user eh, and people would fall out of religion and they don't know why they how they even got there and how are they going to get the communication what i say yeah so communication is I mean, figuring out you only, you only figure out when you communicate. But unfortunately, most people don't communicate. Yes, that one there. <laughs> it is. Also, when we times. say communicate, somebody yeah. who thinks they be a one in Kasa, not just one in Kasa, because yeah, the only conversation mostly you, you guys should be having is about last four things. Exactly. And we'll talk about not th- things that are no, not so essential. You forget to have conversations about how the person is feeling, how to get to know. How they felt about certain things that happened, yeah. The main yeah, I'll so, just so like, that. like I mean, you have mentioned a very important thing. 
Yeah. And I think I I just want to add up to what you said. Mm -hmm. Communication is really important because, and then people do not know, like you said, people do not really know how to communicate. Communication can be made effective when I mean you know that okay you have sent a message and then you are receiving a response. Yeah. Okay. Or I mean you are able to interpret what the person is saying and then give the due response. Yeah. Okay. People do not know how to you know <laughs> the dynamics. I mean, when it comes in to communication. communication but because most of us are always lustful in our in our I mean, we also talk about that one too later we talk about communication in so you identify the There's problem a lot to talk about you, are, you identify the problem you know mm -hmm. you 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 know that okay this is the cause then you know that okay if this is the cause this can be the antidote yeah. okay what is the antidote was it because there was i mean um, you disregarded the person's inter intellectual prowess Mm -hmm. Or was it because maybe you were not giving the kind of emotional validation the person needed? Mm -hmm. Was it because I mean, I mean, you were you were not, I mean, being intimate enough? What was it? Mm -hmm. When you identified, you know that, that okay. If this is the reason, I would want to I mean turn a new leaf now. Mm -hmm. Let's let's start to rebuild. If you are rebuilding, what the solution that you have factored should be shown. Yes. Okay, so it. it's not just about saying it. That yeah. is it. Sure. I mean, I think most that's our problem with the problem with most guys. Yeah, make a make a make. I don't want to make them. Throw me a bit in the car. No cry about it. We are, we are, we form team. You know, so you have said the thing. You know, say okay, this is the solution. You have to show the person say you are serious about. I mean, proving to them that okay, right now you have repented. And then you are showing, I mean, signs, you are showing actions that, um, I mean, confirm that, that you have actually, you've actually you know, changed, learned from her. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. So if it was for the better, it was if the cause of probably lack of communication, mm -hmm. you know, like, okay. I have to pay attention to this lady. Yeah. She she needs that we have to communicate. I mean, how do we communicate effectively? If it was about the fact that you were not, I mean, giving her, I mean, the, the necessary um, validation emotionally, I mean you you, you, you put find out put it away. Show show the person that kind of affection that the person needs. Okay. And you should be consistent with it. And then you can learn. <laughs> so it's good you are watching it. If you're watching it, learn. Learn something. We are giving examples. You should be consistent so, yeah. with it. You learn. Yeah. You get it. <laughs> so there that you consistency. True. So that the person will be like, okay, oh, this person wasn't. And then trust me, it doesn't happen. Oh, 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 no, I didn't know what the wire. Open all day. When the one day is done, when are you wrong? It has to take time. So you take your time. If you, if you love the person, you want to be with the person, take your time. Exactly. And then, you know, kakran kakran kakran. But most of us are men, man, and so back on a yeah yeah hetero. Yeah. Oh, who can cry? What do you say? Love is. It takes a fool to love. Sorry to say, but if if you are not a fool and you are not a risk taker, you can't love. You can't be in a relationship. What you say? Uh, be in a relationship is a risk. It will be out or young and more. As I say, it's a risk. Boss, my nigga. True. It's a risk taking. You are, you are, you, you, you stand a chance of being bit by the snake. What mm. I say, but still, uh, you are doing it because it's what you want to Yeah. Okay. And then another thing I want to add is and showing empathy and then understanding. Where the person is coming from, yeah. you take your time, you listen to the person, you make the person understand. Say, I come here, guy. What's that? Make a start. <laughs> you make the person understand. Say, a cut to You make the person understand. Say, you know where the person is coming from. Put yourself in the person's shoes. What's your say? For our whole fact, for. put yourself in the person's shoes. For who should the shoes? For who should the shoes? So that you can really, I mean, if you put yourself into the person's shoes, you understand how it feels to feel like how the person is feeling, so, and that you know what to do. Said the idea on any other, no, but who said, say in a mean, yeah, yeah, the yeah, yeah, me then, so I wouldn't do it, right? Okay, and then I think it will, it will all have to start with forgiveness, and it exactly. you have to learn to forgive, it's which is one of the hardest things. I remember personally, I'm saying this. On record, AJ, shout out to you. I I remember I asked my big brother, I asked him, 
AJ, how do you forgive? What do you say? He said a lot. I can't say. But still, uh, forgiving is up. <laughs> hey! what, what was the essential thing that you picked up from AJ? What did he tell you? One of the, I mean, the most important thing is it can't be easy. It takes time. What I say? I, I can't agree less. It, it takes time. <laughs> you don't expect that you you will let go. What well, they cannot cry as it's some they kind of a you give it. <laughs> yeah, forgiving is it's not easy, it's not easy bro. Because he used to grease to uh, for father. And then <laughs> he being someone like me, I seem to me shimmy. Me, I'm jovial, I'm playful most of the time. Me here we like when you see me, I'm like that. It's some shimmy, yeah, shimmy. Shimmy, shimmy. It burns me, man. What I say? I mean, we maybe one time I will holler at TG, you know, you know, Mr. Peacherman, come and teach us how to forgive. Oh, I say, come and teach us how to <laughs> forgive. Um, because forgiveness is hard. But to start the trust rebuilding process, it has to start with forgiveness. For, and I say, you, 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 and I, you initiate, think, then you wait for the forgiveness. Yeah. Yeah, you know, I is, think so. It, it is, I think, personally, I think it's that the person you are trying to prove that you have changed or mm -hmm. you are trying to wait. When his or her trust back mm -hmm. to determine is okay, I'm forgiving you. You oh. understand, okay? But it will take time. It will take time. Like For, it doesn't come easily. Hey, bro, you 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 maltreat somebody's daughter, sir, and then I mean, somebody's daughter will maltreat me, sir. I don't even care if you want more than your own. Can we more? Because I mean, it's true. The girl, them sugar. <laughs> the lady's smart. The pamu. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it's true because. Yeah, yeah, you man, the pepper more. You say, man, the you say, man, the young man, I know a day, I know a day, but yeah, 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 But like, I mean, what you have said, I think is really important. You identify the problem. You make consistent, and I mean, consistent effort to, to show the person that, okay, you have, you have changed. And then, I mean, the other part is you will have to, I mean, forgive. Learn how to forgive. I mean, you need to be as a mobile. I mean, I, I know some people will say that forgiveness doesn't mean that you should accept the person back. But it is, this this point, the person is trying to win your trust back. Okay. So, you, you forgive the person and then... If you see there is a chance of you being back together and you have seen some consistency in the consistency in the person's action, why don't give it a try? It's a risk, like you said. To check some True. True. Two CD. Two C two CD and a dream, bro. Charlie, <laughs> <laughs> easy. I mean, um okay, I think we've touched on this. I was about to ask how do you communicate effectively to build trust? I mean you can, let, let's 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 add let's add something small. How how do you think you can communicate better? You know how well do you think you communicate to you know to start the trust rebuilding process? You know, like I, I think I already mentioned certain mm -hmm. things and then maybe we can we can just say that we can <coughs> later about that. Maybe okay. maybe we'll talk about communication sometime, but yeah. for now I mean what I think is about communication fundamentally is that um you can think what you are sending the message that you are sending across you should be sure that the person receiving that message understands what you are sending there shouldn't be misinterpretation yeah interpretation yeah. Yeah. Yeah, interpretation so you should there should that there should be that clarity mm -hmm. you communicate clearly in plain languages i don't know that communication doesn't come in only verbal i mean um, yeah. Gestures and, and everything. Exactly. So I had to be now. Yeah, you should show in your face. Exactly. That's a, that's show it for communication. Me. So true. you have to be true to yourself. I'm learning. Show, show, communicate. Let the person know that okay, this thing that he did, I'm happy. I'm happy. Show. If you're happy, show it. You don't. You don't smile how your your face is frown. <laughs> <laughs> I said no, I got it. Why is it so hot? Why is it so hot? When Why is it? I'm laughing. I'm laughing. Why is it? I'm laughing. Nigga, I'm laughing. You know, so the 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 the, 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 the message that you are sending across should be clear. Mm -hmm. You should make sure that the person understands what you are saying. 
you the person that you are receiving the message mm -hmm. you know if for emphasis sake or for clarity sake it is also always advisable to find clarity mm -hmm. from the person okay if the person made this gesture what does it mean if you don't understand it find it like find out from the person what does this mean okay or you can follow up with some gestures or some questions or whatever means of communication that you are having to find out okay this is what he the person means plainly but that was you know and the person knows open like say it in plain words what i say you have to go to biscuit man let's go to cook man bro 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 so there should be that clarity Mm -hmm. And then, if the person receive the person receiving the message should also, I mean, give a feedback. Yeah, you understand. True. So Very the feedback true. that you are giving, you should also make sure that it is also understood. Yeah. So Very it's true. that is a fundamental principle okay. about communication. So the, a lot of people speak different languages. You understand? I mean, when it comes to communication, that is where I mean, I believe love languages all come come inside. Mm -hmm. you, you like the last time I said something, you were laughing. Mm -hmm. I I love 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 yeah, yeah. We are Belated. Belated salad yeah. to you. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, we love you all. all hey, shout out to Farida. All, hey, Farida. All, all our Muslim friends who yeah. be watching this, you know, have a big one there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, you know, so that, that is what I think. For now, that is what I can say about this. Maybe later, we, like you said, we will make some. Yeah. I think we have to. There are certain things you can, can put, put out, and then you know so talk the language, about them. The language yeah. that you also speak during communication is also important. Yeah. You know, you should know how to speak with your partner. Yeah. You know, there there, there are some languages that you go how no matter what you say, opa, say it humbly, say it say <laughs> <laughs> and no, 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 you have to know how the person will also, you know, be able to like how you'll be able to communicate to the person effectively. But is it wrong to ask? It's, it's silly, you know, but I'm asking. <laughs> is it wrong to ask somebody to teach you if you offend somebody and you ask the person to teach you how to be good for them, how to be good? To it's them? not wrong. Personally, I don't think it's wrong. But if I will be in but people, the thing is, they don't even. <laughs> They don't know yeah, how. If you don't, if, you, if you don't know how you want me to treat you, it's difficult. Then really how do I? How how would you even treat yourself? That is it. Some people don't know. When you say that, that is crazy. But sometimes you, the person, will have to now start to try some cues. You know, okay. to to see if that cue would fit in. I mean, getting to the person. Mm -hmm. That's just a hand. So yeah. relationship is a whole. Charlie, oh, relationship be on. I think so. I was saying, can buy new chair cap. That's right. For real. I mean, Ejuma. Who in that story? Ejuma. Whoever is coming next, you know, in Ghana to become the president. Yeah, yes, Sremo. What I say, but the moon chair cap. It was it will be uncle registered in relationship. Where is our boy? Is not coming one day. Ah, be uncle registered in the. Be unware. What I say, na kabosumi. Everybody will get a stipend. You know, aka client po. Because he's a jumo. It's a learning process. We, you, you learn every day, and I'm I'm glad we can also. I'm glad we are also putting our quota out yeah, there I mean, to help learning. people build their relationship. In as much as we are also learning yeah. to better ourselves. Okay, now let's go to this. Um, how do you think uh, conflict resolutions should be handled? You know. Conflicts or disagreements in a way that you will be able to maintain trust. How do you think? This um, is, this is really deep. This, this is this, this is, is quite <laughs> BC question number five. Oh, yeah, what's it? Conflicts, hmm. conflicts or disagreements in a way that probably will maintain trust. Yeah. Hmm. Hey, you it's, it's difficult. I mean, like I, like I said, you know what? I think that time quite Yeah. So, so what we do is 
let's find time we will talk about I mean, there are lots of things we have to figure out if single out and then talk about them we will look Regarding at how trust. to you know yes mm -hmm. how to resolve conflicts you know handle we have to do a lot of research and then learn from you know yeah, yeah. but you know handling conflicts and disagreements i think say you have to start with being empathetic and then understanding where whoever you from like is coming from sure, sure. so and then be able to listen to the person yeah. the okay or no assimilate give the person that audience don't be in a rush to you know talk back sure what i say why you see why you see it can be flimsy things. sometimes there are certain things they are flimsy they are petty but Utsi. for you to be able to you know understand the person at at a glance and i said i just in your glance with it i just as a way of hearing, no, we stand. You say, "All right, my things are petty," but if you if you wait, if you talk and you listen to what the person is coming from, it wasn't just a flimsy thing. It wasn't way. So when you be empathetic with the person, show some form of empathy, whether it's flimsy or not, you show some form of. I mean, being empathetic towards someone or listening to someone or showing some form of way to someone is not being weak. I think it's one one of the things, guys. And yeah, it's yeah, yeah, yeah. it's sort of an egoistic thing. It's, it's One of the things that guys we, we forget to look at, you know. If you say oh me tea no no as a as a, as a way Jimmy be but any Jimmy what Jimmy cry love is <laughs> love cry Jimmy cry. Yeah, we always when you have to be bra, you know. Yes. A punch me, a punch me. Yeah, I mean, I think you've made a very valid point, very yeah, solid, yeah. important point there. So, yeah. being empathetic, it will even help you to identify what is causing the yeah the, uh, the problem. Very, 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 so, very, very, if you're very, able true. to get that, you you then figure out what the problem is. Mm -hmm. Then, you figure out the solution to the problem. Okay, I think that that is that is how okay. we may be. So, if God be in your side, and hope on the way, you know, or don't bow, and then you're able to build the trust. I didn't know where you go now. I'm here to Then you're able to, you know, how to the, it. you lay it block by block. Know it me as a sharp. How do you maintain the structure? How do you maintain the trust that you built over time? Mm -hmm. So, like you said, you have to be consistent with what you have actually resolved to. Yes. Okay. So, you have you have identified the problem. <laughs> you have gone through all the processes. You've empathized. You've listened. Identify the problem. You have figured out that this is the cause. You have formulated a solution. Mm -hmm. You are now showing, to, like, showing the person that you have repented. And you are doing. You are not doing that anymore. Okay. So that's the thing. So what shows how many money now? So it's about the only thing that wouldn't break trust again is your consistency. Mm -hmm. Okay. Regular check-ins. Exactly. And an active listening. Exactly. You know, that is it. I mean, that's what I think. Should should you have to you have to be re I mean, actively listen to your partner. This thing, I'm a man of Sorry, I'm not off my phone. No offer. Hello, baby. How are you doing? I hope you're nice. The night was nice, it was good, and I hope you're doing well. And yeah, I'd be a bravier. Hey, bravier. All the bravier boys. I'm to puppy. 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 i A relationship is a lifetime thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As I say, if you intend to, you know, see to it to the end, then you have to ensure that whatever would make the relationship stand, you you do it. Okay, whatever good thing that would make, do it. If you need, you need to spice your relationship up, right? Uh, to to make that stand, do it. Sure. It's worth it. Yeah, it'll be worth it. Mm, it's good having it'll a good it. relationship and getting a peace of mind down to all the time. Um, causing havoc here and there. 
<laughs> okay. So, bro, any final words for our listeners and viewers out there, those who are tuning to DJK Studios? Okay. So, I mean, I'll probably try to summarize all that we've learned. I mean, if we know how what trust is now. <coughs> we know that trust span across about three fears. We know that trust is about, you know, um, trust. There, 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 when it comes to trust, mm -hmm. there's a fear where emotionally um, you have to you have to show some worth of I mean trust. There is a sphere where intellectually there should be some I mean I mean how do you put oh, what's in the word now? Can you cheat? Can you cheat? There's a cheat oh you know, so and I was saying in about three spheres, there are there are places that there are spheres that we we have to show our trust okay. intellectually, emotionally, and then physically. physically yeah. And then aside that, we have also spoken about how to you know rebuild trust when it is broken. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have spoken about the fact that you you need to you know empathize with the person, communicate. I mean, figure out what the problem is, and then f and figure out the solution to the problem. Work it out. Be consistent with what you are saying. Sure. You have spoken. Of, I mean, I, I think this this has been one of the most educative podcasts that we have had. Yeah. And then if You're you going are, forward, if, if, it's going to be. If you should follow, I mean, what the conversation that we've had so far, I mean, it will help you a lot. Yeah. If you also have something that you would want to share, I guess you can share it in our comment section. We yeah. need it. Down below in the comment section. <laughs> or, you know, you can holler at us on Instagram, on TikTok, and then on Twitter at DJK Studios. Now, thank you, Nana Bachidosti, no, for sharing your insights on this it's conversation. Always a pleasure, it's always a Charlie, um, yeah, okay, and I hope you out there, you also learned something. I said, like I was saying, we all need to learn for a better relationship, for your relationship to be able to stand the test of time. And then I want to say this. Remember that trust is a journey, not a destination. You have to keep building. What I say, you don't expect, say, oh yeah, yeah, where do you Because I didn't be I had to say, who sit down? Now, unfortunately, baby, I'm not a baby. I'm a crap. What I say. You can't have a 100% because Nipa, we are not 100. Sure, what they are saying. So, any day, uh, today something will happen, tomorrow something will happen. Work it out. But remember that you keep pursuing and pushing, as I say, to make things work, to work it out. So, keep on keeping on them. I believe you will have little to no problems with the relationship, what I say. And then, um, I hope you enjoy this. You learned something. If you enjoy this and you love this, uh, remember to like this video. Um, share so that others can also learn and then if you are new here please don't forget subscribe because we have lots of lots and lots of you know educative, educative videos coming your way on the get down me here I'm DJK and then Anabuache has been my guest on here remember to follow us on all the social media platforms at DJK studios okay on TikTok, Instagram, and then on Twitter. Currently, that's where we are now. TikTok, Instagram, and then Twitter. And one very important thing, like and share. Like and share. We all need to learn. We all need to learn. Okay, so that people stop chopping uh, chopping big fast. Because big last, fast. Yeah, yeah, does. What I say. <laughs> okay, I hope you, you enjoy this. Like I said, see you. And always say, pursue, overtake, and then recover. Until next time, let us meet again. Get down. Peace out. Cheese.